Turkey's defense industry is making headlines again. Tubatak Sage has unveiled the design of the much-anticipated Gokhan Ramjet-powered Beyond Visual Range Air-to-Air -air Missile, or BV-RAM. Announced in 2021, this missile could redefine Turkey's air combat capabilities. In today's video, we'll explore the details of Gokhan, LICE compare it to its European counterpart, the MBDA Meteor, and analyze its potential impact on Turkey's defense strategy. The latest update on Tubatak Sage's website reveals that ground tests for Gokhan are already underway. Once these are complete, captive flight tests will follow, paving the way for firing tests. The Gokhan missile features a design optimized for internal weapon bays, with rear fins significantly smaller than those of the MBDA Meteor. This approach avoids integration challenges like those faced by, by the Meteor with the UK's F-35Bs. Interestingly, Gokhan shares similarities in fuselage design with Turkey's Gök Doğan missile, hinting at the reuse of existing components. This design decision not only reduces development costs, but also simplifies integration with platforms like the F-16's Tusak Khan fighter jet and the Murad 100A as a radar. What sets Gokhan apart is its ramjet propulsion system, which provides adjustable thrust mid-flight. Unlike traditional solid-fuel rockets, this allows for greater range and better performance in extended engagements. This feature places Gokhan in the same league as advanced missiles like the Meteor, offering Turkey a significant edge in air combat. Additionally, the missile's design is tailored for stealthier operations. By fitting internal weapon bays, it reduces radar cross-section, an essential feature for modern air dominance. Now, what does this mean for Turkey's defense strategy? Let's break it down. Enhanced air superiority. With Gokhan integrated into Turkey's modernized F-16s and the upcoming Tusash Khan fighter jet, the country gains a weapon that rivals the best in the world. This positions Turkey as a key player in the air-to-air -air combat domain. The development of Gokhan aligns with Turkey's broader goal of self-reliance in defense technologies. This not only reduces dependence on foreign suppliers, but also strengthens its geopolitical stance. Gokhan's deployment could alter the balance of power in the region. Neighboring countries may need to reassess their air defense capabilities in response to Turkey's enhanced arsenal. If successful, Gokhan could attract interest from other nations, much like other Turkish defense products such as the Bayraktar TB2. This could bolster Turkey's defense exports and economy. The unveiling of the Gokhan missile marks a significant milestone for Turkey's defense industry. With advanced capabilities like adjustable thrust, optimized design, and seamless integration with modern platforms, uh, this missile positions Turkey as a leader in air-to-air -air combat technology. What do you think? Can Gokhan live up to its potential and rival the meteor? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest in military technology. See you in the next video.